gentlemen, that was play it cool. And uh, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, we are in the presence of greatness because the super furry animals are here. <laughs> uh, well, two and a half of them. Yeah, by the skin of their teeth as well. Uh, again, I thought that Jim was going to have to put on a wig and pretend to be the super furry animals there, which is what we do when guests don't uh, turn up. But, uh, well, uh, thank you for coming, first of all. And uh, I'll first of all just come out and say that I think you rule on this show. I'm not saying that just because you're here, but, you know, we love you on this show. So That's we're nice. glad you're here. And um, uh, I wanted to say, uh, it's, down to, it's kind of down to your greatness and bands like the, the Stereophonics that, that people in Wales are being taken more seriously. Do you reckon that's the case? No, we're just taken seriously because we can terrorise people with close harmonies, you know, because we're Welsh. Well, that's, a good, well that's, that's always a good thing. Um, I mean, uh, do you think that if... if, if I, see, I see the Manic Street Preachers, right, as the, as the, the grandfathers of, of, like, new Welsh rock. Does that make you the, the, the uncle that dances funny at weddings? <laughs> <laughs> do, you <know> what, <laughs> do, do you know what I mean? There's, there's always that uncle, that, that, you know, that mad uncle that always turns up to weddings and goes like, well, and, you know, is funny. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Look at me and your father. <laughs> you know, that, that guy. And because it's in a wedding, it's embarrassing, isn't it? Embarrassing pieces don't embarrass us. Well, I, I, wanted to, I, I wanted to talk sort of, um, kind of semi-seriously about, uh, I have this theory that, um, because I was born in Cardiff, right? And it's only since, really? yeah, yeah. It was only, it was only since uh, at the Royal Infirmary. Uh, yeah. it, it was only since like you guys and the Manics and stuff that I could hold my head up high and say that I was born in Cardiff without people sort of falling about laughing. You know, I think that I think that well, you know, the Welsh are the victims of internal racism more than anybody else because like there's no there's it's xenophobia. There's yeah. a distinct difference between racism and xenophobia, is it? Because we can pretend to be any other so Western European nation yeah, whatever you know I can pretend to be anything I want because what do people sort of say what, what are you Yugoslavian or what yeah I can pretend to be Yugoslavian or English or anything yeah. you know we're toughies you know what I mean so, no, what, what, what's the toughie. problem yeah. well there is no problem obviously for me or you but you know every time I say I'm born like, before you guys came along when I say oh, I'm born in Cardiff everybody just like makes sheet noises and falls about laughing do you smack them yeah, well, you know, there is that, but I'm a, believe, I'm a believer in peace and, uh, you know, I'd much rather run than fight, but then uh, that's me. No, I mean, you know, uh, my serious point is that, that there are, that the, in media, there are no Welsh accents, are there? It's always Northern Irish accents and Scottish there's, accents. Well, from, right, to the point, there's no North Wales accents, yeah. I've got a low frequency North Wales accents, yeah. Yeah. And I'm never, you know, there's never any North Wales accents in the media. You might at a push get a valley South Wales accent, yeah. Yeah. There's underrepresentation of North Wales accents. Well, yeah. that's it. And that's my belief in life, you know, that I should put the North Wales up. Yeah, we've got, we've got a ripple of applause there in the studio. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> yeah, cool. I mean, uh, apart from, who is it? It's, it's like um, the only ones that are representing, and they're representing South Wales, are few out of EastEnders. Oh, we're having a rave uh, yeah, right. yeah, with Lenny. Who's Lenny? Twat. And that was he? Oh, damn yeah, right. Uh, twat is the town. Twat is the town. Uh, he meant the town in the Orkneys. No, no, he's all right. Yeah. He's, he's like a picture of the uh, first show, isn't he? Yeah, 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 yeah. Him, yeah. Like, it was huge, it was. <laughs> yeah, there's him, and then there's that bloke off the adverts that, that sells noodles that come in pots. Yeah, he's yeah. Cool, he, right? I love him. Silver, silver, silver. Yeah, him. We love him. We want to get them both on the show. Actually, have well, a Wales Day when we have, we played nothing but super furry animals and stuff. Silver. And stuff. Yeah, we love him. Um, yeah, it's, it's only the people that the people that are like high in. Um, you know, in the media, are the people that are, that are Welsh, are the ones that people don't know are Welsh, like Richard Burton and, and Anthony Every, Hopkins and people like that. Jack, Jack Daniels as well, so, eh? well, Jack Daniels as well, so. Jack Daniels? Yeah, yeah. of the whiskey, Daniel. of whiskey <laughs> fame. <laughs> there's, a all right, there's, there's a religious reformation in Mid Wales in the last century, and all the distilleries had to close down because they were out of business, so they all immigrated to America. Is that right? Up, uh, it's a little known fact that Jack Daniels is an original one. Is that right? Yeah, totally. It's Blimey. a uh, bourbon was invented in Van Gogh near Bala. Yeah. Uh, Van Gogh? And I, <laughs> so we drink it with pride. Excellent, fantastic. And I, well, next time I uh, imbibe, I will do so with a pride as well. Um, there's, the, I wanna, there's this story that I, that I always tell my mates right about you, and I just needed to check with you whether it's true or not, because I, I always, I, for years, I've been spreading it around, right? I heard. Spreading what? The, well, this story that I'm about to tell you, right? That, um, that I heard that Alan McGee came to see you, the, the boss from Creation, right? When he was thinking about signing you. And you used to sing all your songs in Welsh, yeah? No, 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 he thought that all the He thought we were, right? Yeah. That, 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 that was their accent. The, well, the story I heard was, he said to your manager, yeah, I love them, they're absolutely brilliant, I love the band, but can they please sing their songs in English? The thing is, I think <laughs> the night Alan McGee saw us, we all oh, the songs were, were in English anyway. I yeah. think it's just our North Wales accent. Yeah, well, I'm a bit... Scottish, isn't it? 
Oh, yeah. just lots of Rangers. Well, yeah, we, we're all Celts, aren't we, then? Yeah. You know, we're all Celts together. Except but, for Rangers. Well, yeah, there is that, yeah. Oh, well, yeah. I... <laughs> <laughs> all right, well, well now uh, we have this... Um, each week uh, on, on Up For It Live, which is this show, we have this thing called The Plate That's Great, where we, we say, if, the, if you go out and buy one record that's released on Monday, buy this one. And uh, coincidentally, it happens to be Demons. And um, it, you, it looks like you had a real laugh making that record. Uh, I mean, Griff, you're, you're, not, you're not internationally known for, for smiling, are you? But you, I could see you there. You don't see you smile. smile. Yeah, I mean, you smile in this video. I did, it it looks like a real laugh. Yeah, yeah. I haven't seen it yet. Oh, well, you'll see it in a minute. And you do, yeah. you do crack a real big beaming grin in it. Yeah, but we were in Columbia, though. OK, well, enough said about it. The less said about that, the better, I think. <laughs> I think we'll just go straight on to playing demons by the super furry animals. Clarity. Super Furry Vision, that was demons. By these guys, it was their fault, the Super Furry Animals, who are fiddlers. They, they, you know, they, they fiddle. They fiddle. <laughs> and um, that is the plate that's great, because of all the records that were released on Monday, we reckon there is none higher than that. Hey. Yeah. Um, now, I wanted to, uh, while that record was on, uh, that's one of our crack gadget of the week uh, things there. That is, uh, that is to get rid of spots which you probably oh, don't have a problem with. I saw you doing that, yeah. Oh, right, yeah, yeah, with Jim eating loads of chocolate, and then, yeah. Was yeah. that you, man? Yeah, yeah, that was us, that was us. Um, but while, that, uh, while your um, Demons video was on, you were impressed, I could see, by the wall of mullets. And, uh, and, and you have a mullet-related story, which I want you to tell, because you should, you know, I, I heard it, but I want everybody else across uh, the UK and Ireland to hear it as well. well. No, every time you go to Germany, we go millet spotting. Because <laughs> they usually turn out to be Welsh. <laughs> 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 what, so you were on this... <laughs> what was it you want to bury? Denmark and Germany with that, we'd seen the ultimate mullet, mullet moustache combo. Mullet. Just des oh, describe it. Oh, mullet moustache combo is a, is a fine thing. Yeah, 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 but yeah. we saw, ah, uh, uh, no, it was a woman from San Francisco. <laughs> <laughs> that, 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 what, had the mullet and a moustache? No, no she had a perm on the top. And um, and the she came together with the long hair coming down. But, and, oh. and, um, and she had the moustache, really. No, that is incredible, because yeah, that's a white... So down, she's a music journalist from San Francisco. So, that, and, uh, that is amazing, that's very rare, because that's not only a female it, but that is a female puffle. Yeah, that is a permed mullet, or a permulae. It's a female we... combo mullet. <laughs> yeah, it's a combo mullet, yeah, 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 nice. Yeah. Well done, boys. God, I love you even more now. <laughs> <laughs> right, now, if you could just... Well, you can carry on fiddling, actually, but uh, we want to play this game that we always play with musicians and pop stars like your good selves, where we fire a two-part question, and, and it, the, the game is called You Have to Say Because. You just have to pick half of the, uh, of the question kind of thing, and you have to say because, right? So right. if I say to you, right, Dav, Right. Hanson or Manson? Hanson. You have to say. I'd go. Uh, I'd rather have Brunson. shit. <laughs> he would rather do a poo <laughs> than pick one of those. Uh, right, because because I would rather have a poo is what you're yeah. saying. All right, that's fair enough. All right, Griff. Sean Connery or Roger Moore? Timothy Dalton. Because he's from Colwyn Bay. Because he's from Colwyn Bay. Nice, good answer. Very good answer. All right, Dav. Spice Girls or Spice Boys? You know the Spice Boys are, right? right no, the yeah. Liverpools, Liverpool yeah, well, Spice Boys. Uh, spice yeah. Boys, because eh, I spot Liverpool. Oh, is that right? All right, fair enough. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's a very good, that's a good answer. All right, uh, Griff, let it out or keep it in. As, as you fiddle with the Chin Gym, that is the Chin Gym, which was another of our crack gadgets of the week. What does uh, that do then? That, is, that goes on Jim's chin. So and chin the, yeah, if you've got like a flabby, saggy chin. It like gets me. rid of you. Well, I, I wasn't going to say, you know, I, I would, would never be so bold. But, but uh, hey, what are you asking? <laughs> well, outside then. Um, the, it's to get rid of, like, if you've got a bit of a problem chin. You, in the privacy of your own home, you can work oh, your I'll chin out. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to be. So, okay, I ask you, Griff, let it out or keep it in? Drop out. <laughs> drop out. All right, drop out because. Uh, uh, ask me tomorrow. Okay, because we want your answer. Okay, all right, all right, Dav. Church of England or Church of Elvis the Divine? Church? <laughs> church of England or Church of Elvis the Divine? Are you mad? So you're, you're going to pass on that one, are church you? Church of nothing. I pass. Okay, Church of church nothing, of because organised religion is not cool. Is that what you're trying to say? No, no, I'm just trying to say uh, that I'd rather be the Pope. All right, yeah. no, good answer, good answer. All right. Um, Griff, mods or rockers? Mockers. That, was, that wasn't your question. Oh, sorry. Just, yeah, yeah. Griff, mods or rockers? Um. <laughs> I'll repeat the question. One more chance. Mods or rockers? They, they'd been a finger, they'd. Oh, no, it's a dildo. They call me the blind. Um. 
Would you like to translate that? No. Because my Welsh is not up to scratch. Uh, <laughs> uh, Whoops. Uh, I think that was rude. It was. <laughs> <laughs> so rude. All right. All right. Okay. All right. Next question. All right. Next question. All right. All right. Do you have leg or breast? Leg or breast? Leg or breast? Both. Because? Because I'm a fan. You're a big fan of, of chicken and all things chicken related. All right. All right. Fair enough. Uh, okay. Um, question number eight. To, to this goes to Griff. Uh, this life or friends? Um, this life. Because. Um, um, better than No, because they did a superb snot and speed scene with this on the background. They, they, they did a. No, they, it, they, it, they, they, that was involving going uh, fast in a car, I think, uh, is what you were talking about there. No, 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 and, uh, no, no. Yeah. <laughs> you had the scene in the restaurant, though, with this snot and lights of speed with our two. Yeah. No. Okay, alright, alright, okay, okay. Okay, question number nine Lennon or McCartney? Foxton. <laughs> For Bruce Foxton, because he's got a mullet. Nice. He's found the mullet pile. He's found the mullet pile. Okay, the last question, uh, leaving this life out of it completely. Uh, give or receive, Dav? Give. Give. Because? Because it's better to because give. Because it's better to give. All right, that's fair enough. All right, um, uh, before you go, can we get you to sign some stuff? Because we're no. giving, we're doing, oh please, cause, well, uh, let me tell you, we're doing yeah, this competition yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, to, give away, to give away really cool prizes to people who've got the rudest addresses in the UK and Ireland. Well, like 69 well, Funny Street, well, you're getting exactly, yeah, yeah, exactly. Oh, yeah, yeah. Well, you can write in. You could win, well, you could win your own stuff. Uh, you could win other cool stuff. There, there's Twat in, in, in the Shetland Islands. There's Muff. Yeah, no, Muff. The Orkney Islands. Uh, that was the Orkney Islands. There's Muff, which is just down uh, below uh, Donne um, Donegal or something. Well, there is a 69 Funny Street in Cardiff. Brilliant. We can write in. Yeah, we'll give you the address later. Yeah. All right. Fantastic. All right. Now, uh, our break coming up. Thank you to the Fairy Animals uh, for lighting our rings. And um, uh, after the break, David Arnold and the Propeller Heads Moby and Limerick, prepare to have your ring lit. That is our thing. <laughs>